But let's go down to Florida yes, for let's the go to viewer Florida. discretion segment of the day. Exactly. I don't have the music, though. It's pretty... It's pre- Well, you have the music up there, right? I don't have the Florida music. Oh, yeah, no. But you have, oh, the, I have the music. Oh, I have the music. Let me just give you a, a hint of what this story's well, about. Well, you're going to get it right here because it says it right here. Well, let me give you... This is the only appropriate music to play when we do a story such as this. Let me crank it up now. Crank it up, right? Crank it. Don't you back that ass up. This is unedited, though, by the way. Yeah. And we don't have to worry about it. That's why we're explicit. When Juvenile drops the beats back in the day, you can back that ass up. Tony was singing this all morning. It's one of my favorite songs. So a Florida man... Speaking of backing that ass up, yes. A Florida man was arrested down in... Florida? Columbia County, Hello. Florida, Hello. by a sheriff who decided that the sticker that he had on the back of his truck was, was it a pickup? Inappropriate. It was a covered, you know, one of those covered pickup trucks. So it's got, like a, a it's, it's got a, a what do you call it, a uh, top on it. No, what's one of those things called in the back? Not the ass. A cab over or whatever. No, it's not know. a cab over Pete with a reefer on. I don't know. Whatever. But this is the sticker that he had, and it says, I eat ass. Let me repeat again. It's a. Bu- it's not a bumper. Is it on the glass part? You know where the windshield yes. is. Is it? You know or where it's on the back. It's on the back on the glass. Well, on that's the, where the ass is. And I that's mean. <laughs> exactly. You know where they have like a lot of people always have the little stick figures with yeah, the, like yeah, the yeah, mom, yeah, the dad, yeah, yeah, the baby, yeah, the cats, yeah, yeah. and the dogs. That's exactly where it was. And um, so the the man is claiming that his First Amendment rights were violated after he was arrested this past Sunday. So he was pulled over and arrested yes. for having a sticker on the back of his uh, his, his name conto is, cover, whatever they call those things. His name is uh, Dylan Shane Webb, 23 years old. He was pulled over by Officer... What um, time of night was this? Highway it was like 2 in the 90. morning? No, it was just on a regular daytime. And the officer spotted his I Eat Ass sticker on the back of a Chevrolet truck <laughs> and claims that that sticker violates Florida Statute 847.011. Oh, I know that one, yeah. Which deals with possession and distribution of obscene material. How's that obscene material? Yeah. Now... The deputy asked Webb when he pulled him over, says how a parent of a small child would explain the meaning of those words when when passing him by, to which re- Webb replied that it would be up to the parent. In an effort Have you to- seen some of the bu- bumper stickers in front of you on your road and, and those people aren't being pulled over? You just tell the young child, son, you know, sometimes in some places people eat different things. And, you know, and donkeys in many parts of the world are food. Uh, yeah. And so a donkey, as you know, is also known as an ass. And it might it might offend or upset little Johnny. If I wrote, I true. eat jackass, right. or I eat donkey, that would, PETA would be upset. Yes. But if you just shorten it and say, I eat ass, people would understand, and the young children, then you can then, as a parent, tell them what it exactly means. But, uh, but uh, the officer <laughs> tried to instruct Webb so that it would be less offensive. He said to remove... One of the letters. One of the letters? Yes. But Webb refused and cited his First Amendment rights to announce to the world. Do I have to go down there and protest on his behalf too? Of eating ass. <laughs> Anybody that feels like <laughs> Webb. <laughs> There you go, Tony Bruno. But you it's, can eat ass, but remember one thing as Luigi checks in now. Never go ass to mouth. No, I'll tell you that no, right no. now. You can eat ass all you want. And you know what? If there's two consenting adults, eat that ass. Eat that ass. That's what you want to do. But you're not really, you know, anyway, you don't need me to explain it. <laughs> do you need to What letter would he ass? take out? So if you're going to go and say... All right, officer, which letter would you like me to remove I believe, I, I'm assuming... Can I add a vowel? Can I add a consonant? <laughs> I believe, this is just, I'm just assuming now that the officer was going to tell him to take away the I so that it would just say eat ass. What's the difference? It's somebody's eating I ass. I agree. The fact that he's acknowledging that he eats ass... Just eat ass is, is basically telling everybody exactly. else to eat ass whether they want to or, or not. not. It's an individual choice. He's if it's his choice to exactly. eat ass. It's unbelievable, man. I mean, I'm going to have to go down there 
and, and go down there and, what would and it, organize an ass march. Would it be offensive if it said, I eat bush? Uh, it could be a baked beans. Maybe it, maybe the bush baked beans, Be- you know? Exactly. The guy with the dog, the bush guy, not George Bush or any of those other bushes. Stay out those bushes. Let me tell you that right now. I think I think this officer overstepped his bounds. It's ridiculous, man. So if you did get rid of the last S, I eat as, what the that hell does that, that mean? That doesn't make any sense. The, act, the, act, the cop actually asked him to get, re- I- get rid of the letter I? I don't know. It doesn't say which which letter he asked what to What happened if you changed the letter I and put like just the letter U, and you said you, you eat, eat ass. ass? Then you're then you're insulting somebody. Exactly. You're saying it's basically saying, "Hey, jackass, you eat ass. You're an you're a butt munch, right? Remember people call people <laughs> butt, butt munches, munches? <laughs> slap dicks, butt mu- butt munches. So then, if he put you eat ass, that would be like taunting the person behind them, which could probably lead to road rage. Because say a person behind them, following this guy in the truck who happens to be behind him, and he sees you eat ass on his bumper sticker, then that person gets angry. He mm-hmm. says, how dare you? And then he pulls over, gets out of his car, and they throw down. He's telling that person behind them, without any knowledge of that person's proclivities, that they eat ass. Yep. I think it's That's an outrage. That's personal responsibility. As D'Amico says, that cop is an ass bag. Well, I mean, how many people have it's you seen? It's an asshole. I've seen, I've seen the fuck you stickers on everything. They're, they're all over the place. <laughs> this is just this guy saying he's not, he's not insulting anybody. No. He's not saying, telling anybody to do things. He's just saying, hey, I eat ass. Where, 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 where have we come as a country when someone can't even acknowledge their own particular and, idiosyncrasy, and, weakness? Since when has it been a bad... He's just showing his own sexual proclivity. Exactly. Isn't that what we're supposed to be supporting to each their own? <sighs> Luigi tweets in, I'll be honest. I seen I see that once in a car. I'm pulling over and inquiring within. <laughs> nothing but, wrong with a little ass eating. There's nothing wrong with a little bump and grind. There's nothing wrong with backing that ass up. Twerking. When women twerk, are they not exposing the butt that they probably would like if someone maybe would say, hey, love that ass, back that ass up, as Juvenile once proclaimed back in the day. So we on the Bruno Nation, we support all sexual... uh, Unless you're an actual cannibal, and then you are really going to eat that ass. As in, I don't support that. As in, go Jeffrey Dahmer on them. No, yeah, you are correct. We're not talking about actually people eating human flesh. I mean, maybe in the Donner Pass, they ate ass, but they ate everything else, too. Well, it when is they were stuck out there the in the Donner Pass. The fleshiest part of the body. Yeah, because there's really not much meat in the ass. No. Well, it's no, a, it's got a lot of fat. There's a lot of fat, but the taint itself is just a taint bit of protein in there, for the most part. You know what I'm saying? Did you have to go there? See, this is why the show is explicit. <laughs> but it's, but we it's were not, just we're not to talking explain. about anything that's... <laughs> This is this is why we had to explain to everybody why we had to change the show to the explicit rating. I know, but we're not Voila. we're not doing we're not doing shock jock radio. I'm trying to make it I'm trying to put it in a in an educational vein here. I'm trying to explain. What happens if it was a woman not for example, say a woman had that on her car. Uh-huh. And the police pulled her over and it was a woman. So that said, let's just imagine I'm driving our Jeep. Picture this, yeah. Picture this. I'm driving our Jeep Cherokee mm-hmm. and on the back it says I eat ass. Right. And then the cop pulls you over. What what are you going to say to him? Well, first of all, if he was offended by it being with a man, then he should equally be offended by it being on exactly. mine. Exactly. But, but to <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> There should be, he should not be offended by either. I think he's the one with the issue. Because he's obviously never eaten ass, and he doesn't realize how fantastic it is. Again, ass isn't for everybody, okay? (laughs) I'm not here condoning the eating of ass or any other body part. I'm just saying that this man has the right. There's no law that says you can't eat ass. Is there? No. So. Well, you know what? I don't know. There are still some really weird laws on the books, Tony Bruno. There are many The states- age of consent in a lot of states is like 14 years old. I know. There's some bizarre... I, and here, I do you realize how often I say ass? I was just going to say something that I realize now is so appropriate. There are some bizarre ass laws in 
this country that are still on the books that other th- other laws have negated, but they're still there. They have not been removed. I know. You can do weird things with animals in a lot of states still. No, no, no. Right. It's not that you can. It's that there are laws on the books that you specifically cannot do weird things with animals. And the reason why they had to put them <laughs> those laws in there is because people did. <laughs> <laughs> Bob and Valley Forges, I cannot believe this segment about eating is going on this long. <laughs> it's not that busy, uh, man. It's not that busy. I mean, we're breaking it down. They won't even. First of all, they can't even show this this story on any television show, right? Except on ca- even on right. cable, they can. Unless no. I don't. Probably, you know, who could probably show this. Who is what's his name on uh, Comedy Central? Oh, um, Tosh.0? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, he can, he can put Tosh up anything. Tosh can do a whole ass cable. segment. This is, like, this is like the cable version of uh, regular Paul Notes, Philadelphia's own Made of Sons, wrote a song about this. The Ass Eater. <laughs> oh, there he is. Sing it now, John. Daryl. My other brother, Daryl. Do you realize that every time you click that, it makes a noise? I know, I like that. It goes through the beat. And John Oates banging with the with the uh, mullet. Bubba 182. There is nothing better than a segment on ass eating with Hall and Oates playing in the background. <laughs> I mean, really? Where else are you going to get this? They should do a remix of this. Get Juvenile to do a remix with the back that ass eater up, baby. Everybody now. <laughs> 